learned how to identify the asymmetric traffic at firewall and how we can bypass it to temporarily fix it. So first we will see why it's happening. So whenever any source is sending data to the internet or anywhere and uh, in return traffic it's uh, following the different path whether there is a different switch or routing coming in between. So in firewall you will see the packet as non-sync traffic. So it will be you can say uh, sync act or act packet you will receive at the firewall and firewall will silently drop that packet. So once you will do packet capture you will be able to identify like oh, what is the first packet it's coming or also you can check in this monitoring tab. In simple term you can say like uh, from source to destination or destination to source the traffic is uh, following through the different path. So we can fix it uh, through two way like uh, first on interface basis or you can do it for entire device. So we will check both. So first we will check for how we can do on interface uh, you can say zone basis and then we will do first uh, you have to go to the network and then you have to go to the zone protection and you can give any name and then you have to go to the TCP drop and here you can see reject non sync traffic as no and asymmetric routing you can choose the bypass and once you will done you can click uh, on you can say zone and on zone you have to apply that zone protection profile and click ok and then you are done you have to do commit and now we will do for entire device basis so you have to go to the device and now you have to go to the setup and now you can go to the session and you can select the TCP se TCP set setting and then in asymmetric you have to just click on bypass and just you have to do commit and we are done